I'm so, just gonna go pick this guy up. Okay, so Tyler, let's look at the head end we were looking at that has a pair of eyes, but how many antennae, what do you think they use the antennae for? And oh, how many like antennae? Smelling and things like that. Absolutely, that's how they smell. That's why he touched the food with his antennae. That's right. So how many like antennae do they have? Or how many pairs of antennae do, do they have? It looks kind of like when you put them in the water. It looks kind of like they have like six. Ah, so it turns out that they only have two pairs of antennae. Wow. A really long pair and a shorter pair. But you're right, that shorter pair really looks like it's two. But that's because every single appendage, every single piece of anatomy, uh, every body part that's projecting off a crayfish is what is called biramus. Bi means two, ramus means branched. So in other words, every single piece that projects off a crayfish has, has a second branch. Yeah, let's see if he's, when he goes underwater, if we can see. If we can actually see it. So that large antennae has a teeny tiny little other branch that comes off, but that shorter antennae, the pair of antennae that's in the middle, the two parts to the branch are pretty much about the same length. So that's why it looks like there's six, but there's actually only two pairs or a grand total of four this, antennae. Uh, yeah, let's look at, oh, look, yeah, you can really see how that shorter pair looks like there's yeah. four projections coming I wonder if you can up. tell if they're male and female. Oh, that's a great idea. Can you, uh, where do you look? We look at the underside, yeah. so let's pick this one up. Um, how do we tell if it's a male This or one actually, female? it looks like doesn't have the white things. Like, you remember the big white things on the other crayfish? Uh, well, let's see the other crayfish. So we think actually, this one is, that one was a female that you just think. looked at. This one is a male, because those are, those white things are claspers, which is what it uses to basically grab onto the female when they're laying eggs. So the male crayfish has those hardened white claspers right there where the cephalothorax meets the abdomen, so right at that intersection. And the female. And the female does not. As Let's you, go back to the female. As you can see right there, but there are these other things called swimmerettes, which oh. they use actually where the eggs are laid on, and those swimmerettes carry the eggs. Excellent. Okay, so swimmerettes carry the eggs and the swimmerettes can move. They're flexible yep. so that can get air, water currents and oxygen over the eggs and clean the eggs off. Hey, is that tail jointed? How many joints are in the tail? Oh, let's see. It's like on the parts of the tail, there's like there's one joint because those, like, those um, lines are probably the joints. So oh. one, two, three, four, five. And it looks like there are like six, because like, if you count the last one. Okay, so six joints on the tail, which is also known as the abdomen. And as you told us before, when you put the, uh, that one time, the crayfish tried to get away from you and it scooted backwards by really flexing its abdomen underneath and uh, curling its abdomen. Right now it's curling its abdomen. Huge muscles in that abdomen, huge Let's muscles in that tail. That's what we eat when we eat lobster tail. Fresh cra crayfish are basically just freshwater equivalents of lobster. Let's the lobster see. are going to be in the ocean. Yep, so they're tucking that tail Let's underneath. See if he will, if she will um, go back and go back. Um, oh, so we were actually we're wondering if, if they have tail flaps. Can you pick up maybe the, uh, well, let's see if the female will actually look at the tail flaps for us. Mm. Yep, if you hold it Ooh. that way, that should work, oh, I think. She just took them under. No, 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 it's fine. If you, if you, I can, I can see them. Can you try to pull the tail flaps out of it? Oh, look at her spreading them out. There's a tail flap on either side, one tail flap on either side, and a middle point so, as well. So, looks like there's one middle one, and then two ones behind that middle one, and then two ones behind those. Yeah, well, so when you look those. at this, there you go, sorry. If you look like this. There are two. Right, well, it's actually, remember, every appendage has two branches So that's technically it. one this tail This is one flap. tail flap here. Then she has another tail flap on the other side, yeah, and like in that. the middle, and this bit right there. One. Yep, and that's just a middle point, the end of her abdomen. And actually, that's where her anus is. So that's actually where the poop is going to come out, in case you care about that. Um, and then, how about the number of joints on a leg? Are you comfortable trying to look? We can actually at least see that there are a lot of them. Can you point out some of those like joints? The joints are basically because yep. that's one joint close to the body. Because mm -hmm. you can actually kind of 
Because nice. it bends there. Though it bends real, a lot right there. Because that's another joint. And then there. So one, two, three. Well, it, this could be a fourth. Is it yeah, a fourth? so we've got Where all these different off. joints. And if you look, those joints are all set at different angles. So even though it's almost like a door hinge. Wow, it looks kind of like she's trying to pinch me with her legs though these legs actually the pincher things have are come have come off and on some bigger crayfish it actually hurts a pretty big a lot to ha even have like a little one pinch you yeah you certainly don't want those claws those pinchers to pinch you you can really see the bumps and the ridges in those claws oh, yeah. that will help them really put a yeah, bunch so of pressure. Like there are a lot of bumps in Yeah, there. a lot of pressure on what they're trying to crush. And that way, do you know what and crayfish they also eat? Have, like bumps there. Yes. What do crayfish eat? Um, I think like I don't know.